Londa, thank you. And we continue our team coverage in Eugene this afternoon. Art Edwards is live there with fallout from reaction as well from fans. And Art, how are people feeling about this big change today? Well, right now, for the most part, it feels like the fans are really on board with the change of Oregon going on to the Big Ten. It is new student orientation time at the University of Oregon, so there are people on campus. News spread fast about what was going on with the Ducks and the Big Ten. And with the start of the football season really less than a month away, there is a lot of talk about that, what this means for Duck fans and how they'll support their team. Wherever they go, I'm still an Oregon fan. I mean, I'm still here. Wherever they go, I'm an Oregon fan. I think this is exciting and I think that what it's going to do on a national level for exposure for these, these schools that are transferring from the Pac-12 Pac um, is going to be a positive. Now there are some questions that are out there. Before the move came uh, of Oregon moving to the Big Ten, there was a, a Republican lawmaker, Shelley Boshart Davis of Albany, who said that she wants to convene a legislative panel to try to understand exactly what the move to the Big Ten would mean and what the consequences of that would be. The Oregon State graduate is concerned about the economic impact on, that this move might have on taxpayers. But right now, it seems like it's probably too late because Oregon has already announced that they are making the move to the Big Ten in 2024. Reporting live from Eugene, Art Edwards, KGW News.